All right, here's the BYU solar funnel video part two. Uh, I've got the glass Walmart cookie jar inside here and an oven thermometer. This is a two gallon glass cookie jar. I think it's made by Anchor Hocking and I bought it at Walmart. Inside here is just a stainless steel camping pot with a bunch of garbanzo beans and water in here. So I'm gonna stick them out here for a couple hours to soften the beans up. I've had it out here for about three minutes and it's hitting the 200 degree mark inside there. Okay, so let's come back and check on it in a little while. Well, the sun went behind the clouds for a little while and we're still rolling about 225 degrees or something like that. This is the 20 minute mark. And the sun's coming back out again. And we've got a fairly cloudy sky out here for once, which is amazing. So even with the clouds rolling in, we're still up over the 200 degree mark inside there. So that's plenty of heat to go ahead and cook these beans a little bit. And uh, pretty much it's higher than most crock pots right there. So even on kind of a cloudy day out here, you can still get pretty close to crock pot temperatures. Of course, this is New Mexico. Okay, we'll check it again in a little bit. Okay, it's been about three hours now and we're still around the 225 degree mark. Sun finally came back out. So we'll check it again in a little bit. Okay, I kind of forgot about it out here. It's been four and a half hours and uh, it was pointed out of the sun for a little bit. You should turn it about once an hour. And I just turned it and the temperature is climbing back up again. So we'll come back in a couple more minutes. And after about two minutes or so, we're getting pretty close to 180 degrees. And it's been about 15 minutes. And we're back up to a little over 200. And that's with the funnel not aimed properly either at the sun. The sun's a little bit lower here, so this thing should actually be tilted up a little bit. This thing's pretty beat up. I just put it back together today. And uh, you can tell that, you know, even with the terrible, the terrible aluminum foil inside and all the wrinkles and the dirt all over it and everything, you know, this thing's been through the ringer, um, it's still working and you're still able to get over 200 degrees inside this glass jar. So definitely something you want to have, as it's just a piece of folded cardboard.